<laughs> Do you hear Taika? <laughs> we are still in Vegas. We are in the Mount Charleston area this morning. Look at how gorgeous this is. Can you believe this? Maybe you can, but I can't because my lame ass California ass has never seen anything like this in our backyard like this. I mean, we do have Big Bear, but bro, is it anything close to this? What's up? Wanted to get out of the house today, get with some nature. Now that we have Papa back from California, just wanted to go out, do something, but it's been so hot in Summerlin, Vegas area. I don't know what, I mean, this is Mount Charleston, so we're up in the mountains, but um, yeah, it's gonna be like 107 today. And I'm like, but I wanna get out. So we came up here and it feels, let me see. It's 66 degrees. Right now it's 66 degrees. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's oh, so nice. comfortable. Whoa, don't do that, that's for doggies. I told them to keep on the lookout if we see these guys. Ooh, so cute. We're at Cathedral Rock right now. Hey, that's for doggy. Hey, no more, no more, no more. We're already getting in trouble. Come on, let's go this way. Let's go. Let's explore. Monkey. Yeah. Monkey, what'd you see? Chocolate in a bag. Chocolate in a bag. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> Disgusting. So Bart has this thing that he tells Taika all the time. And what happens every time you see poop? Every time I see poop, I go, hey, look, it's chocolate. And he goes, in the beginning, he didn't understand the game. So he'd be like, that's not chocolate. Papa, Statue of Liberty. Liberty. Statue now, of Liberty, boy. But then now he knows the game. So when he sees poop, poop he goes, hey, Papa, look, it's chocolate in a bag. Statue of Liberty. A true? Statue of Liberty. Let's go, dude. Statue of Liberty. How beautiful is this spot? I almost feel bad that I'm like wearing sunglasses because it's like colorizing it, you know? Yeah. Versus like it's not, I'm not taking Statue it in for what it should be. Statue. So I'm gonna turn my sunglasses around. Nice. This is gorgeous. I love it here already and we haven't even started. They're not. The fire ants are red. Those are mungus. Look at these guys. They're massive. Yeah, the yeah, look. black medium look. ants. Look at the, that's the scale. It's the size of my thumbnail. Holy. Holy. <laughs> Should I put it on my hand? No! Ah! Ah! Don't bite me! Ah! Then you get it away. You don't know if they're poisonous. Those things are huge. Hey, hey don't mess with why them. Why would you do that? <laughs> There's a little chick monk. It started off as a song. I didn't moving, mean for it. He's moving his little tail tail. Where is he? Right there on the little branch right there. I see a, he's not moving that's like. Guys, oh. do you know why there's bees there? I saw one there. Okay. You're the one dressed like a bright flower. Big cutie guy. Okay, I'm guys, uh, I love it here. Around. This is an absolute dream come true. Like, what? It's beautiful. Huh? This is so perfect. Look at that. And they're so, like, I saw a chipmunk. Like, what? Chipmunk, so cute. I love it here. I'm never leaving. Oh, big, good day. You're gonna be there. Uh-oh. Yeah. Wanna just move? No. Don't, don't aggravate it like that, because you can make it angry. Oh, there it goes. Look how cool this is. So this is pretty high altitude. We've only been on the hike for maybe like 10 minutes maybe, and it says we already went up 10 flights of stairs. So the altitude is pretty steep, and I can feel my breath going, <laughs> you know, even like a, a world-class athlete like me, when I get tired, that means everyone else is going to get tired, so it's cool that they have uh, That's funny. a I bench. Yeah, We've well, been sitting down like a lazy bum. Oh, okay. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> They're playing hide and go seek. I think so. Like, where'd you go? Look at how beautiful this trail is. Yeah, get your wiggles out, dude. Run, run, run. Look at 
you pop over there. Getting some artistic shots. Yeah. We have people closing in on us. Let's keep moving. He's coming. Keep hiding. So beautiful. I'm definitely winded. Look at that. Ah, there's a cat here. Like I heard a cat. Aha. Hey, there you are. Oh, pues. Mid, I think it's more than midpoint check. I think we're right about yeah, we're to the at the it. end. And there's been a train change. It's so gravelly, but it's more wood than the rocks that it was before. It's so beautiful. Oh. Look at all these little guys. Oh, yeah, they're not squirrels. Why did I call them squirrels? Oh my god, is this heaven or what? And by the way, we've made it to the top. Look at this. Ah, how cute! So cute! They're everywhere. Look at them. Look how cute. They want to eat the cranberries. Oh my gosh. Hi, so dudes. Cute. Yeah. Ah, you see a monkey? Cute, huh? Okay, look at Taika. He's just trying to tickle them. <laughs> that was really good. He's right here. I wish I could. I wish you. Everybody can. Yeah. I wish I could take one home. Yeah, everyone does. They're so cute. <laughs> so cute, huh? Nuts. Take a Sally nuts. I'm yeah, no, no, for no. squirrels. I'm selling for <laughs> some squares. Oh, they heard your they heard your advertisement. Yeah. You have a customer. He's selling nuts. He's selling berries. I'm, I'm selling nuts. I'm selling berries. 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 <laughs> so done with the hike. We all ended up sleeping in the car, and by all, just me and Taika, Papa did all the driving. I slept too. It felt really good. I felt so refreshed. How far was the drive? Um, it's only thirty minutes. Yeah. So we woke up and during the hike, because it was so, it was actually pretty difficult, because it was going uphill the entire way, we told Taika that if he completed it, <laughs> that we would be, we would take him to 7-Eleven to get some, Slushy. Slushy. Oh, what, flavor? We're at. what flavor are you going to get? Coca-Cola. What do you now. think we're at right now? Yeah. Oh yeah, buddy, let's go get our slushies. Yeah, boom boom shakalaka. Which do you want? Same. Here we go. The monkey got his little slurpy slurps. This is the one. This is the winner winner chicken dinner mother. You alright over there? Oh god. Oh no, you're that guy. Oh Jesus. Oh my god. How did you get yours? I helped them. Oh, okay. Okay, how is it? Is it everything you ever dreamed of? Is it perfect? I'll try it. <laughs> Clearly, you know we're still dieting. So that was bomb. Yeah. Go. Ah, uh, it tastes too good. <laughs> you and me. Okay, let's go. Chef Papa coming through. Let me lower the volume. Type as much from Spider Man in the background. Look at this. <laughs> Is 
Just keep in mind that it's diet. Is that even chef worthy or is that just garbage? You know what? When you're on a diet and you can't eat anything anyway, yeah. this is gourmet. You're gonna eat a little bit of everything? Yeah. Is that what's happening? Fuck yeah. You just blew it all off the spoon. Is it good? Yeah. Is it hearty? It was hearty. It is. Yeah. I just don't like the flavored chicken and I can taste uh, the chicken. I know. But we have leftover chicken, so we're trying to Yeah, we're using it. Utilize it. No, that makes my heart happy. But yeah. Chicken, my least favorite. Or maybe I just don't know how to prepare it correctly, but I just never like the taste of chicken. But this is bomb. Because usually chicken is the most agreeable meat in the whole universe. Like, Everyone loves chicken. Well, I would find a way to fight with it. Okay. You find a way to fight with everything, that's true. I made the joke first, loser. <laughs> what do you got going on over there? Whoa. Young lady. So, as we've been talking about since a few months back, we've been running our Barbell Brigade program. Yeah. Um, our Get Lean program. And this is our last couple of days running the program. Which means for the next couple of days after the program's done, we get to do this thing called a cheat meal. <laughs> Where we're just going to go off the rails, eat whatever we want to eat for the next few days, and then get back on track and start cutting again. New program. Um, and in that time, we went to Eddie's World, and Papa was looking for some peanut brittle. Yeah, they didn't have didn't it. didn't find any. Yeah. So while you were out in California... Um, I looked up a recipe to make peanut brittle, and it's actually really easy. Really? So, you found you found one that's diet on friendly. Paper, it's easy. No, this is for off the rails, dude. Oh, this is off the rail style. This is off the rails. You're gonna make me legit, legit peanut brittle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cutie. <laughs> you care about me, huh? No, I just want to cook. <laughs> you cutie lady. Yeah. So it seemed easy on paper, so I'm gonna attempt to make it for you today. Cutie. Yeah. Oh, can I eat something? Well, I can't then. I mean, no, I can't eat can't. it today, huh? No, no one's telling you to eat it today. I'm making uh, it. That's what I'm saying. It's good for. How like, am I gonna three resist? Days. I mean, if you taste it a little bit, it's fine. The only bummer is I couldn't find unsalted peanuts. They're gonna be salted, so we'll see what that experience is like. So I'm sorry in advance. Real quick, it's gonna burn. Okay, what's going on here, Mama? I don't know. I need to focus. I can't answer your questions. Excuse <laughs> oh, me. Oh, day. It's like a cooking show. Yeah. Oh wow. What? That is crazy. What is that? Your peanut what? brittle. I've never seen anything like that. That's so cool. Yeah, this is nuts. Wow. Oh, Damn. Did I marry Gordon Ramsay or something? Well, I mean, let's taste it first, yeah? It, it smells good. Horrible. It smells really good. Is that like caramel? What is that? Uh, like you do caramelize the corn syrup. That's what you're asking. I don't know how to... Hold on. Can I lick that spoon? Yeah. Is it sweet? Yes. It's done. Okay, let me give you, give you, give you that spoon. happening you don't want it to break apart just yet oh it tastes like it's, it has the makings of being something delicious is it uh-huh let's see right well, yeah. look it's drying already yeah it's like cookie dough where like it's not the final product but it's like getting mm. really close i think i did a good job yeah, this was cool. way more expensive than just buying it from the store. Because really? you're buying all the ingredients. Um, but I can make it again and again and again and again. So if you know me, expect some peanut brittle for the holidays. <laughs> Hold on. Papa. Yeah. It's all dry. So essentially, this is what should happen, okay? Yeah. It should just slide right off and you should be able to just it in one piece. Just crack it. And it might not, but... It should be able to slide right off, not stick. Yeah. And you just begin crack a lacken. Okay. You ready to crack a lacken? Okay. Okay, hold on. Let me give you something. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Put the pieces here. Okay. Yeah. Are you ready? Let's see how I did. Okay, here we're gonna take. We're gonna, I'm gonna lift it up. You can just t the, turn the pan around, maybe. Like just Dump switch it. the pan. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. Like just like twist the pan. Twist it. Yeah. There you go. <gasps> Whoa! It's one solid piece. Look at that. Yeah. Just start cracking it. Break it. Hey! Shh, 
Not like that, duty. Yeah, it's good. Try it. You don't have to whisper either. Sorry, I did say. Uh -huh. Let me get some. Let me get some. I did that. No, don't too hard. Just a little bit. Mmm. Really it. good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now you crack it. You crack like this, little by little. Hiya, go hiya. Good job. Hey, good job. Thank you. This is really good. Thank you. See? Can't say it. Yep. So, super excited about how my peanut brittle turned out. It was so good. I feel like I'm going to start making this now for like little presents and stuff. Like holidays or whatever, you know? Something I can contribute. Something that I made with my own hands that you cannot buy. Because... I didn't make it, um, but we had promised Taika today that we would take him bowling. So this is the first time I'm ever even at this casino. What is this called? Sun Coast. Sun Coast. Yeah. It's one of the other local casinos that's OG at Summerlin. It's right across the street from Tivoli Village. It's across the street from Tivoli Village. So we're at Sun Coast. Never been here. Um, we normally went to the um, Red Rock bowling alley. Excuse you. But I don't like it. I didn't like it for little kids. Maybe if we we're uh, an older crowd, like they squish too many people in lanes. So if you have little kids, I'm talking about like, I don't know, that have zero spatial awareness, don't go there. Um, it was just a shit show. So we're gonna check this one out. Okay. <laughs> what happened? So Taika has a tradition of pressing all of these buttons. I don't know why. How did you kick it? I don't know why he went ninja mode this time. Okay? And he kicked it with the shin. Oh, that's Muay Thai style, baby. Yeah, but I just, I don't know what you think it was made out of. Yeah, let's go up the elevator. Well, so far it smells really nice in here. It smells like really nice. Bye-bye. See you later. There you go. Hey, 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 hey. Found it. Oh, this looks like a traditional bowling alley. Cool, there's a little arcade. Look, monkey. There's a traditional food. Oh, God. Nachos. Pizza. Whoa. Where do we get our shoes? Probably over there? Probably right here. I think so. Let's see. So, there is no lanes for today, so we're going to go to the arcade. Oh, dude, let's play this one. Your mom is the best at this game. Your mom is way better than your papa at this game. Oh, yeah. Here we go. All right. For the ultimate Quan Family Championships. This All right. one is so cool. It's crazy because it starts off as a normal game. Watch, you see that? It's already not normal. Okay. Oh, so it drops in, in the middle. <laughs> He's just chilling. His arms are too short. Help him. Oh no. You need help here. His arms are too short. Okay, there you go. There you go. Oh no. Hey, there we go. There we, there's the game. There we go. There we go. <laughs> whoa, whoa, that's a. There you go. Oh my god, party mode! Party mode! Party mode! Oh, monkey! Party mode! Get up, get back, get back! Look at that score. Get back, get back! <laughs> Are you putting in the dip for him? There you go. Look at me, Mike! I can't believe he's this big now. Oh, which are you gonna be? Look. You can do. Oh, you're gonna be the hot babe. That's mama. That's you're gonna be the hot babe. That's mama. Hot babe. Wow, hot babe. But look, he's so big. Press the green one. There you go. Because I hate tunes. I don't like tunes. Okay, you ready? Hit your tunes. Oh, you can't even hear anything. There you go. Oh, here we go. Whoa, you're the hot babe, dude. Let's go. Look how big he is. Go! Go! 
Move to the side, move to the side. Whoa. How cute. I just can't. <laughs> Isn't it cute? <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Just up there. There you go. There you go. Oh, wow, that's the brakes. Yeah. Oh, you gotta use this. There you go. Twist it. Twist it. Oh, there you go. There you go. Like that. Okay, he's a little drunk driver, but we'll get the hang of it. Stop hitting the wall, you're losing! Okay, so he doesn't care to win, he just cares to be funny. I wonder where he gets that from. It's <laughs> just that funny. Oh my god. Let's see if I can get his face. Can I crash the building? Stop! I the building lock. Whoa! Dude, these games are so cool. Check this one out. He's laughing at you. What? Don't say that. Why? I don't know. What did you say that they do that you want to do like them? I want to be, eat dumb donuts. <laughs> Is that what donuts. police officers do? Yeah. You be cutie. I'm going to be my So Tyke, I don't know where it says uh, that he wants to be a police officer when he grows up. And then that was his answer as to why. I know, it's so funny. I'm going to take you to jail. You're going to take you to your papa to jail? Yep. Okay. When he doesn't let you have dessert, huh? Yeah. How do you feel about that? Well, in a few days, we're gonna be eating desserts all day long. How do you feel about that, monkey? Uh, uh, you don't want me to have dessert, then I would pick you up and throw you into jail. And throw away the key, and throw away the key. Yeah, and draw, I wanna I'm gonna put it in the toilet, flush it down to the place. Oh my goodness. Okay, fine, and we're gonna have desserts. Look at how strong my little helper is. He's so strong. He wanted more bags too. We just did a grocery run for the week. Every Sunday I try to get this done. And it's so cuny that now my little my little man can contribute. Thank you, Duty. Okay, so grocery shopping. I just want to run down what we got uh, for our diet and what I got for my snacks. Okay, let's do the diet first. So we're still gonna continue our diet after, are you good? After our little cheat vest. Okay, don't shoot me, dude. You're choking. Okay, so this is for our diet days. We're still gonna cook. So we got some cut onion, um, bell peppers. I got this from the Korean supermarket. Some cucumber salad or cucumber uh, kimchi. Some Pickled garlic, regular garlic, noodles. I don't know if, how Bart's gonna fit this in his macros, but it was not bad. 0. 0.8 carb, I mean 0. 0.8 fat, 58 carb point. Oh my God, seven protein? And they look delicious. Look at this. Okay, we got some 99.1 ground turkey. We got some 93.7 beef. Some fruits, Taika's favorite, strawberries. I got, I love this brand, Light and Fit Greek Yogurt, because it's 12 protein and zero fat, baby. Some shrimp, because it's always a good time with some shrimp. One fat, one carb, 15 protein, oh yeah. These have just been a lifesaver, and I just like the way they taste. I have grandma taste buds, but the, um, Macros on these are fine. They're not great, but they're fine. And then, whenever I'm sick, I like to get some of this. Some ginger, some honey ginger, and I'll probably throw in a lemon. If I'm just too sick to go get ingredients, or for whatever reason, but it's super convenient. And then some gochujang, and then I saw this. Hey mama, can I kill this? This ground beef? Well, 
Because I need six. You just told me I could eat this, by the way, in the supermarket, is what really? you said. Yes. I'll make you some more. No, it's okay. Go ahead. I don't know why you had to interrupt or, or my vlogging for this. Well, if I'm measuring it, then it's going to be this much left. <laughs> I mean, nothing's gonna kill you if you just have. Is it the fat that's gonna kill you? No, I'm just, that's I'm just gonna eat it. Okay. okay. Um, and then we got bok choy, bok green choy. peppers. So that's on the healthy stuff. Okay. So I hope I'm able to give you some ideas what you can do to keep it healthy. If you're also cutting or dieting or just want to eat better. Um, but if you don't want to eat better, don't listen to this next part. Please don't. We saw this and we were like, we got to try it. We don't know what it is, but we're going to try it. Pumpia. I want to do it because it still would fit our macros. Four fat, ten carb, six protein. If and only if I put it in the air, air fryer and I don't put it the way you're supposed to put it in hot oil. Uh, frying it. So I'll try it in the air fryer. Maybe I can even eat this dry one tonight. Okay, Bart is craving some mochi. We wouldn't get it this way normally. We would rather have it fresh, but you gotta do what you gotta do. This right here is so bomb. I don't like chocolate, but I will devour this one. And then, I don't know, this just look good. And I know if I just get one for myself, sticky fingers, fat bar over here. We'll get it too. So I had to get an extra one. This, I just love anything sesame, black sesame, anything. So we got this. And then I got this. I have like grandma taste buds I'm beginning to realize because these are my snacks. Some of these. Some of these. Those are bars. Those are mine. Because these are so bomb. If you haven't had them, have them. I didn't put it in the diet pod because they're not very diet friendly. But... Yeah, no. We can sin, but have sin. You know what I'm saying? So that's it. That's our... Yeah, play, play. Our grocery run. Yep, there he goes. I think he drank the whole thing already. Are you finished with it? No, I have bar in Oh, okay. But yeah, we're about to cook some dinner. And chill. So that's what you ended up making, huh? Yeah, it's a, it came out tasting pretty good, but it, I was trying to make the Taco Bell Mexican pizza, but I just think everything is so lean and dry that it didn't come out that texture. I want to taste it. Okay, go ahead, take a big bite. That Gosh, looks insane. It's actually not bad. It's not bad at all. It's not bad, right? Mm -hmm. Can I get the salsa? Mm-hmm. Mm. I haven't even tasted it before, but that's pretty clutch. Damn, dog. I wish I would have had some of that meat. You make you some? No, because the, the macros on that is amazing. I got 96.4. That one's better. That one's 93.7. No. I'm just kidding. I don't even care. So, done for tonight. My laundry is clean, it's folded, it's put away. I already have Tyka's clothes ready for tomorrow's school day. Um, we're ready to rock and roll. I love to leave my kitchen, well it's not my kitchen, but my temporary kitchen. Clean dishes, I'm waiting for these to dry and I do like to put them away. I like having a fully stocked fridge, like a this one. This size for us is just way too small, but as you can see, we're making it work. I have my meats and stuff for the week, my halo top. I'm like ready to fucking work this week coming up. Really tried to prepare myself to reach all my goals. Um, and yeah, I like putting my head down on my pillow at night and going, yes, I'm ready to fucking bulldoze the fucking Monday, the week. I'm ready to fucking attack. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel. Like, I really do feel that way. Um, so Sunday, like the morning I wake up, like Saturday and Sunday, I just kind of wake up and coast. But then Sunday afternoon, bam, it's like, get it ready. I fucking sound crazy. I know, I'm sorry. But it really is like this. Every single fucking Sunday, prepare for attacking the week. And that's how I like to stay. 
On that note, everybody, I hope I've helped you set up for success even a little bit. And if not, I hope I just made you smile even a little bit. And if not, what the fuck am I doing? Um, at the very, very least, I've captured, I've captured some really cool family moments that I can't wait to revisit when I'm like 75. Because if you know me, you know I don't really like to look at shit in the past. I don't know why. I, I, I don't know if it's a thing or if it's not a thing, but I just don't tend to reminisce very much and go look through things. That's why I don't have like those keepsake boxes, you know, where people keep talk concert tickets and all that shit. Like, I don't keep any of that stuff. Anyway, so I'm at least grateful that I keep this documented. So until next time, thank you so much and have a great day and see you later.